So, hello. I was asked, how do I add multiple materials to one object? So let's quickly go and do that. So what we've got here is we've got three materials. And if you look in, in my material shade, you'll see I've got white chocolate, milk chocolate, and dark chocolate. I want a bar. I want this bar to have some white chocolate, some milk chocolate, and some dark chocolate. How do I do that? So currently... I have listed, if I drag this down, I only have one, one shader inside of this object. So I'm going to hit plus a couple of times. Okay, and on this one, I'm going to change that to being milk chocolate or white chocolate. And on this one, I'm going to drop this down and I'm make this one dark chocolate. Okay, so this object Right, as a possibility currently of assigning three different shaders. How do I do that? Well, let's go do it. So, if I press the 7 key to go top view and zoom in, and we change to wireframe shade, and we move it around so we can see, hit the tab key, right, and press B for box, box select, and I'm going to box select this right hand side. I'm going to make this, okay, dark chocolate. So I, it's currently been pre-selected to be normal chocolate. I'm going to go to the dark chocolate, and I'm going to hit the assign button, and that is now assigned dark chocolate. Okay, and click off it. Press the B key again. I'm going to click and drag over. Well, so we'll, do, we'll do that a lot there. That lot. We'll make this the white chocolate. So click on the white chocolate and assign it. Okay, now press the tab key to get out of edit mode. And we'll move around into ping pong mode. Actually, we'll go into that mode. Can we actually see what we're looking at? There we go. So now you can see that we've got three assignments. And if I hit the render button, we'll see that we've got a multiply coloured or material assigned um, object. There you go. He says thinking. I'm just looking at the front. That needs a knife cut through there. But uh, you can't see it. Well, you can't now. So there you go. We're all done. So that's it. Basically, you need to have enough different material slots. So there's three in here. And we've got the dark one and the normal chocolate and the white chocolate and that's it really there you go woohoo basically you select the polygons and then you assign it to a shader so it's sort of like most things actually uh, it's even like lightweight if you think about it so yeah there you go right that will do that all the learners how to switch this off so file stop recording